What is going on guys? It is gorgeous outside, clear skies, and I kind of feel bad because I saw Yami post about how they've got uh, what he's referring to as a mini, mini tropical storm. I don't watch the news. <laughs> I, well, I, I, whatever shows up in my Facebook feed or that I have in RSS feeds, but ma mainly RSS feeds, I just follow tech stuff. Um, so, I don't know if <laughs> there's actually a tropical storm. I know there was a tropical depression um, that was supposed to come our way, but then the reverse direction and didn't. So we're not getting anything. We got a little bit from some other stuff that came through, but yeah. I don't know what's actually going on in the Northeast. I probably should pay attention to that kind of stuff, but I'd rather just ride my bike! I don't know why I didn't downshift. I just looked in my mirror and saw that the guy behind me was on my tail. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so he posted, he, they're getting like terrible rain, so he can't go out and ride. Um, so, I kind of feel bad that we have clear skies and perfect weather. I think it's probably about 65, 70, 75 right now. Probably about probably about 75. Capperman, they're always right here. Always. <sighs> uh, yeah. So, I don't even know what I was saying. Hey guys, what was I saying? I can't remember. What was I saying? Tell me. Tell me! Oh yeah. So, it's like 75 degrees. And this is, well this is kind of new stuff. This came in, we got a first cold front last week. Uh, otherwise the temperatures before that have been around 95, uh, 95 to 100 for highs, and that came through, and now we're getting like 90, woo, well, 85 to 90, uh, and it's the morning, so it's colder, uh, yeah, so a few different things, I'm working on getting reservoir covers. If you follow me on Facebook or Instagram, you'll see that uh, two of the three stickers that I had made came in. Uh, these are two awesome stickers, but I'll make a whole different video about the stickers when the other ones come in and I've got a buy link for you guys. Um, but I'm working on reservoir covers now. Uh, I don't want to order them yet though because I want to test, test them out. Right now I've got this uh, test one on here. It doesn't have the logo on it, but it's a... Uh, it's the, it's the wristband that would be, or the cover, it's technically uh, made as a wristband, but that's pretty much what a reservoir cover is. Um, so I'm testing this out, I just want to see uh, how it lasts, what the durability on it is, if it gets like super, super stretched out, which I know, like, if you keep it on here for a few months, obviously it's going to get stretched out, made this color, but I just want to see how bad it is. So. Working on that, if this works out, then reservoir covers will be coming in down the line. Uh, I'm also working on shirts. I know what I want to get. I'm just finding the right shop for it because I want to find a shop that can print it in the way that I want it. Um, there's a certain style of printing that I want on the shirts. I already know what kind of shirts I'm going to use. Believe me guys, these are going to be the best shirts you've ever worn, best t-shirts. These are my favorite t-shirts by far. I love these things. Um, I've got like 10 of them. I just keep, I just collect them because they're so comfortable. Uh, so I promise that even, even if you're uh, iffy about getting the shirt, which I don't know why you would be iffy about getting the shirt. I mean, it's got the freaking awesome Odinosity logo on it, but the shirts are super comfortable as well. So uh, look out for that. I'll be keeping you guys updated on everything. And I need to get over. And what else? Oh, I'm also almost at work. But what was I going to say? Oh, I'm going to Cedar Point this weekend. So I don't know if any guys are in the area, but maybe uh, maybe if you're headed out to Cedar Point as well, I'll run into you. Going up for the weekend, flying up with my fiance. Boom. Why are you guys, what are you guys doing? Uh, um, yeah. It's uh, 
flying up Friday night or Friday afternoon in the in the Cleveland and then driving over to Sandusky where Cedar Point is. If you don't know what Cedar Point it is where Cedar Point is, it's a freaking awesome theme park run by the Cedar Fair Company. I need to get over. Thanks dude, thanks. Yeah, they've uh Ooh, uh, who's a what's it? I think I know that guy. What was I saying? Why do I keep forget, freaking forgetting what I'm saying? Uh, oh, Cedar, <laughs> Cedar Point, Cedar Fair. Uh, yeah, so Cedar Point is probably their main, most popular and well-known site uh, because of uh, the records that they've broken. They've always maintained like. One, top one or two for number of roller coasters for an amusement park. Uh, oh, no wonder my throttle's jumpy. I left it in A mode. Yeah, they've also got... Uh, they've beaten tallest and fastest multiple times over their history. They got the top thrill dragster roller coaster Millennium Force. I'm a freaking roller coaster fanatic. I'll make a whole vlog dedicated to roller coasters. I've already done it. Uh, but that was ages ago. That was within the, like the first few months that I had my first channel open. Uh, so I definitely want to make a new one because I love uh, roller coasters. I love them. I love my roller coasters. They're very nice to me. I like how they take me up really high and then drop me down really fast. So I try to take a roller coaster trip every year. And I haven't taken mine this year. Go ahead. Okay. Don't know. Oh my gosh, dude. That's what you get for staying in the turn lane. Um. But in all reality, like, that freaking turn lane is ridiculous. Um. It's because it's all the construction. They've added two turn lanes, apparently. Uh, because they're like, well, they can't go straight, so let's just make them turn. Um. Uh, yeah, so. That's that. I'm going to Cedar Point. Let me know if you're going to be there. Let me know your favorite roller coaster. Let me know your favorite theme park. But I gotta go! Ah, Motonocity and Double T. Freaking Double T looks like he's on a hot rod. This is his dad's bike. <laughs>